quick video today. <clears throat> Yesterday I did a live bloom class for the Shelly Art uh, class and I have some colors left over and I wanted to try a swipe. Yesterday I did a really fun swipe um, with these colors. I don't want to. Um, it was really nice, but I realized that all of my swipes are just I do it in a line and out and that's getting pretty boring so I want to try something that I'm I don't think I'm very good at or I haven't been in the past but I want to practice and that's what uh, Shelly calls the pseudo swipe where she pours a bunch of colors smooshes them around first and then swipes after I, I find that that for me they never look really good so let's do that and see what happens. Um, hi, babe. Hello. I'm doing an. I got your war paint on your face. Look. Oh, I already have paint on my face. <laughs> oh God, I haven't even started yet. Um, so I will try to remember the colors. The orders don't really matter since I'm going to be schmoozing them around. But uh, let's start with just a bit of Amsterdam turquoise. There, this is pretty thick. My two, it might be too thick. I'm just gonna like kind of drizzle them thinly because when you have thick paint, um, it doesn't move as well. So I find if I drizzle them, it becomes thinner. Then let's go with, I'm loving this TLP, this little pigment. Their pigments are amazing and you can get them at the Fluid Art Company. This is called Mermaid. I love it because it has like a greenish when it dries. Um, I'll show you that. Those colors look very yes. similar. Yes. Well, you'll see it. different. So you'll see this greenish, this is almost dry, is the Mermaid. And this, I'm going to be using Velvet. I love it. This color I'm not using, but that's sequins. So the pigments are great and you don't have to add any two paint or anything to them. Um, they hold their color really nicely. Is there gold going in this? There is. Nice, that's my favorite. This is Interference Gold. This is golden. That's um, the only gold? No, I'm gonna have a darker one too. Um, TLP also has a great Interference Gold called Ball Gown, but I've already used all of it. Yeah, I just walked in here, but this looks very different. Yes, what you usually do. it is. I'm going to swipe this actually. Swipe. Um, next, one of my faves. Why don't we go? This is uh, Matisse Flow. This color is called Midnight Blue. It's also very thick, so I'm going to drizzle. I don't know what's gonna, if this is even going to look nice. We'll see. So the whole point is I'm going to smoosh it around and then swipe on top. Okay, smoosh. Define the word smoosh. Um, smoosh. I'm going to swipe it. With a piece of cardboard? Yeah, I'm going to swipe it first. Smoosh. And get the colors around and then I'm going to swipe it with is that the, the cell art, activator. art terminology? It is. So here is TLP Velvet. This is that blue purpley interference, which I love. It gives, just even on plain black, it gives a really great color you can see in the yeah, light see that to me it looks almost like a, a little bit see-through-y yes that's it looks what it different is different than the other when you resonate it gives a really cool 3d look um what else do i want here oh a little bit of this what about my gold it's, my dark gold it's that's coming okay. this is matisse australia i'm gonna leave you alone i'll come back and see what you do okay thank you this is southern <laughs> ocean blue matisse this is also, I use quite a bit of this color. I almost want to just blow this out, but no, we're not going to do it. And finally, Elliot's request. Um, this is Deco Art 24 karat. It's also quite thick. So we'll drizzle around. I'm wondering, should I do silver too or just leave it at the gold? Probably just the gold. So. How is this gonna work? So what I'm gonna do is I have cardboard from a canvas. Let's make this in the middle a little bit. Um, and let me just get the sides off. I have cardboard from a canvas. I'm just gonna rip up uh, a piece of it and smooth it around, kind of like I'm already doing a swipe, but with no cell activator. And then 
I will swipe with a style activator. So I just have this um, cardboard. I'm going to use this lip. Maybe I'll. This is too big. Let's see. Um, all right, just like that. Who knows, right? Did I just ruin all this paint? You never know. So I'm going to spin it out a bit to make it bigger. Without making a mess. And then I'll get to swiping. Now my problem is, is how to know how to make good shapes and stuff. Um, I didn't really prepare so much. So I have two swiping tools. I have a smaller palette knife and then a bigger one. So let's start with, I have my Payne's Gray Style Activator. It's the Shelly Art Recipe. I have a 15% off discount code in my description. So I'm just gonna put some on my palette knife. Okay, is that too much? Maybe. And then I'm just gonna like, you know, get to work, whatever it is I'm doing, I have no idea. Those are cute cells anyways. Very juicy. Oh, can you give me some paper towel, babe? <clears throat> sure, is the smooching part done? It is. How'd it go? Look at those nice juicy cells so far. That's pretty cool. Thank you. What do you need more? No, it's too much. No, it's <laughs> okay. So just that was the smoothing thing? Yeah, I smoothed all the colors around first. That could That's... have been a painting all on its own. I know. <laughs> the colors are really nice. So yeah. now I'm going to add some white. It's that gold, man. That dark gold just brings out every color. Because yeah. it kind of like sits underneath a lot of those colors. Yeah, it makes the cells. Pop. Do you see what I'm saying? Like it's, it's blue, but there's like gold. And when that's resin, I love that. That's my favorite about your artwork. So, how All right, I'm going to let you go back to your thing. I'll come check it out. I don't know what I'm doing, so. <laughs> yes, you do. Did that work? I don't know. I might have, oh, I had a little bit of black paint on there. I would like to say that I am proud of you and how hard you've been working to get all these orders and how. Thanks, you, babe. Yeah. And how you're working to make sure that each one's perfect for the customer. And I, I'm trying. You know, yeah, no, everything I've seen that you put in a box and sent out has looked amazing. So, again, if you guys are looking for a certain special present for somebody, or even your house or something, I think you should uh, contact Lisa or see what's available and get on, very, get on the bandwagon. It's very nice of you, babe. <laughs> I try to be. Honey. <laughs> okay. It's true, I've been kind of busy. <laughs> Can't complain though. All right. So. How, is this even gonna be nice? I really have no idea. And again, I wanna thank all you guys who were um, donating to my PayPal. It's been like really, so kind and overwhelming. I never thought that this would be my life <laughs> and I'd be able to be doing this almost full time. Well, I'm doing it full time, but you know, um, I'm doing so much learning and teaching. It's been really great. So I want to thank you. All right, how are we looking? Kind of look like looks like ghosts, but I'm gonna do another swipe this way and see what happens. I know swipes take so long, but you really, especially with this, because you're really planning your. Um, <laughs> I just forgot art words. Uh, what it looks like. So I'll think of it in a minute. Um, oh, that was not a winner swipe, but maybe I can blow it out. Let's go 
kind of weird. Um, we definitely need a swipe going on here. Should I do more white? Even though I'm not loving what's happening with the white. No, I'll just keep it the black. I need the gray. Uh, all right. I guess I'm going with this kind of same pattern go moving downwards. Does it kind of look like sperm? I hope not. All right, we need something going on here. And then I guess I'll get to tilting. I don't know if this looks nice, guys. But then, you know, I never know. <laughs> All right. And then we will tilt her out and see how we did. Okay, so I wanna get some of this gold. Oh, I should've. So I, I put my cell activator on this side. I'm actually gonna put it on the other side so I can swipe this way. So take that off and yeah, put it on the other side. You have to think about those things. Or I do anyway. Okay. Okay, I mean, I could go on forever. Let's just tilt it and see what I did, right? At this point. So I'm gonna wait for that to kind of come back in the middle so it all tilts together. Um, now I'm gonna think, I, I like these, so I'm gonna bring it out there first to stretch that corner and keep it where it is. Um, I'm just waiting for that to come back and then do I like the white though, or should I go over it? I don't know. I don't want to go over it too much because it will ruin everything around it. So I'll just wait. All right, let's see how we're moving here. <clears throat> so, are we moving together yet? No, we haven't come back yet. Come on, oh, the white part also is stuck. You're gonna give me problems. Maybe I just have to spin it out at this point because, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna spin it out because I don't wanna lose all the cells. Um, if I tilt, the places that are stuck are just gonna fold over themselves. So we're just gonna spin her and see. I'm gonna go slow because I don't wanna get paint everywhere, which is gonna happen anyways. Okay. I do wish I could have tilted it to make the cells bigger, but I like, but I'm just tilting it down a bit. That white really bothers me. Um, I guess I can smooch it around. Yeah, why don't I Let's be crazy? I'm just gonna take this fork and at least pretend. And oh, I got some black paint right in the middle, guys. Am I ruining it? Now it just looks like weird ghosts. <laughs> being crazy right now. Yep. I might be crazy. But at least I kind of covered it up. Okay, let's keep spinning and see if I just ruined it. my favorite scenario but yeah I definitely have to spin this edge off more um you want to get all the paint off so it doesn't crack when you dry all right 
right. I mean, it's definitely going to look cool when it's resin. Um, I do actually like that gold. Here, this is the way I'm looking at it. I do like that gold thing I did. Well, it's kind of cool to me. There's some pieces that I don't like. There's wonky cells here. Um, I don't know. I think this is a walk away. Let's see how much. Oh, we'll see what Elliot says. Coming. I don't know, babe. Let me see. Oh, dude, that's cool. Is it? Yeah, that's cool. Yeah? There's a lot going on there. You don't care about wonky cells. You don't care that, like, that white thing is this weird. Well, now that you're pointing things out, but, like, oh. I still think... No, I think that's cool. Okay. Very wavy and watery and yeah. stormy and yeah. That's the first yeah, like that's cool. Okay. Yeah. Well, there you have and it. And I think hold on. Yes. Again, remember what we always say about a uh resin? Like the yeah. resin's gonna make a lot more of that pop out. Yeah, it is. Like even I'll do a close up in the light so you guys can see that how the interferences are working. I love that velvet color. That's like that down here, that purple blue. Yeah, but I just love that the gold works with every single color. There yeah. I, there hasn't been a color I've seen. Maybe the fluorescence it won't work so well with, but like Anyway. So, you don't think this is ugly? No, I don't think it's ugly. Okay. But again, it's teach their own, and I think someone's going to fall in love with that. It's stormy. You can okay. hang that any which way on the wall. Yeah. And again, I, you have to see it. I think... Yeah, once, I'm going to do a close-up. And once it's resin, yeah. I think it pops even, like... The resin is, like, 50% of the art, if you ask me. All right. Well, I'm going to do a close-up. Thanks for joining. Let me know what you think, as always. Is this a fail? I never know anymore. Um, have a good day.